God, you take away the sins of the world. Have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Grant us peace. Behold Jesus, the Lamb of God. Behold Him who takes away the sins of the world. Blessed are those called to the supper of the Lamb. Lord, I am not worthy that you should enter under my roof, but only say the word, and my soul shall be healed. Act of spiritual, I desire to receive you into my soul. Since I cannot at this moment receive you sacramentally, come at least spiritually into my heart. I am... pray the prayer to Our Lady of the Assumption. Most Holy Virgin Mary, Mother of Christ and our Mother, you are the fairest fruit of God's redeeming and faithful love. You are assumed into heaven and sing of the Father's mercy and still accompany us with the Mother's love. In this time of pandemic, we come to you, our sign of sure hope and comfort. Today we renew the act of consecration and entrustment carried out by those who have gone before us. With the love of a mother and handmaid, embrace our parish, our city, and our nation, which we entrust and consecrate once again to you, together with ourselves and our families. In a special way, we commend to you those particularly in need of your maternal care. Mary, health of the sick, sign of health, of healing, and of divine hope for the sick, we entrust to you all who are infected with the coronavirus. Mary, mother of consolation, who console with a mother's love all who turn to you, we entrust to you all those who have lost loved ones in the pandemic. Mary, help of Christians who come to our rescue in every trial. We entrust to your loving protection all caregivers, medical workers, doctors, nurses, and frontliners. Mary, Queen and Mother of Mercy, who embrace all those who call upon your help in their distress. We entrust to you all who are suffering in any way from the pandemic. Mary, seat of wisdom, who were so powerfully filled with the light of truth. We entrust to you all who are working to find a cure to this pandemic. Mary, mother of good counsel, who gave yourself wholeheartedly to God's plan for the renewing of all things in Christ, we entrust to you all leaders and policy makers. Accept with the benevolence of a mother the act of consecration that we make today with confidence and help us to be your son's instruments for the healing and salvation of our country and the world. Mary, Mother of the Church, you are assumed into heaven, our true home. You are enthroned as queen at your son's right hand. We ask your intercession for the needs of our country, that every desire for good may be blessed and strengthened, that faith may be revived and nourished, hope sustained and enlightened, charity awakened and animated, Guide us, we pray, along the path of holiness. Mary, our Mother, 
bring everyone under your protection and entrust everyone to your beloved Son, Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. We wish to thank all of you for joining our Mass here at the Manila Cathedral. Thank you to those who are from other countries, who are members also of the online community of the Manila Cathedral. And thank you to the different social media platforms that are sharing our Mass. Maraming salamat po sa inyong patuloy na pagsuporta sa mission ng Manila Cathedral. Yesterday, as we celebrated the 426th anniversary of the elevation of Manila as an archdiocese, and while we are still within the celebration of the 500th year, 500 years of Christianity in the Philippines, we in the Archdiocese of Manila launched the 500. YOC Mission App. This 500 YOC Mission App, it could be downloaded free from Google uh, Play uh, Store and from uh, Apple App Store. And uh, in this app, you will find helps in order to gain indulgences during this year of Jubilee here in our country. There are many informations that you can find in this app. You could even make us, and like Mary, may we always stay close to Jesus. Let us stay close to Mary, for Mary, where Mary is, we are sure Jesus is also there. The Lord be with you and with your spirit. Bow your heads and pray for God's blessing. May God, who through the childbearing of the Blessed Virgin Mary, willed in His great kindness to redeem, to redeem the human race, be pleased to enrich you with His blessings now and forever. Amen. May you know always and everywhere the protection of her, through whom you have been found worthy to receive the author of life, now and forever. Amen. May you who have devoutly gathered on this day carry away with you the gifts of spiritual joys and heavenly rewards now and forever. Amen. And may the blessing of Almighty God, the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit come down on you and remain with you forever. Amen. Go in peace, glorifying the Lord by your life. Thanks be to God.